Hello friends, welcome to the class. In today's class, we will be continuing doing the problems from previous year IIT Police paper and it is the 2011 paper which we are solving. So, this time the question says that we have been given two statements. The statement 1 says that y minus x is an integer that is for a and for b we have x is equal to alpha for some rational number alpha and we need to prove that or rather we can say that we need to find that they are equivalence relation on R or not. Well, friends, whenever we need to check for equivalence relation, we need to check for three things that whether the relation is reflexive or symmetric or transitive. If it is satisfying all the three relations, then we can say that the given relation is an equivalence relation. So, let us for the start of this statement a and for which we have x minus y or y minus x is an integer. Now, as x minus x is equal to 0 and we know that 0 is also an integer, therefore we can say that x and x belonging will form a relation and that relation is therefore known as reflexive relation because it is defined from itself only. Now if x minus y is an integer Then from the number theory we know that y minus x is also an integer. So by this we can say that A is symmetric. Therefore A is symmetric relation. Now we need to check for transitivity and if we have two integers like x minus y and another integer is y minus z and we know that the sum of two integers is again as an integer therefore x minus y plus y minus z is also an integer and that gives x minus z is an integer and from this we can say that a is also transitive Now as A is reflexive, symmetric and transitive relation, therefore A is an equivalence relation. E. That whether B is an equivalence relation or not. The statement for B is something like that that x is equal to alpha y or we can say that x over y is equal to alpha and alpha is a rational number first of all we will check for reflexiveness that whether the given statement P is reflexive or not and as we know that x over x is equal to 1 and which is a rational number therefore statement B is reflexive relation
now if we have x y equal to alpha it does not implies that y over x will also be a rational number or we can say a rational number it is not possible in every case of say for instance we have x is equal to 0 and y is equal to some number like 2 so we have 0 over 2 that is equal to 0 and which is a rational number but if we do 2 over 0 that is an undefined quantity so this is not equal to a rational number so b is not transitive in nature therefore b is not an equivalence relation so let us check which is the correct option in the given question statement 1 is true definitely and the statement second is false because B is not an equivalence relation now let us move to the next question the next question says that consider five